need to get ready. We're gonna go tour city of Melbourne. Here we go. Oh. If you're gonna check in luggages in the airport, domestic flights in Australia, you can only have seven kilos. It's ridiculous. I mean, it includes your purse and your check-in bag or your backpack or your hat or your, you know, anything. For this guy, look, I'm gonna show you what do I have in this carry-on. Ta-da! I got my camera gear, my shorts, my beanie, souvenir, got some paperwork. I mean, you might as well travel without anything and buy your stuff in the island or Cold Coast or Melbourne or in Sydney. It's stressful and it's expensive. First flight had to wait an hour and a half just for an hour flight and then had to wait for another delayed flight. I mean, it's always delayed. And when I asked one of the representatives, you know what they say? It's not Tiger Air's fault. It's not Tiger Air's fault that they forgot your luggage. But anyways, and I'm gonna start. I'm gonna stop ranting. I'm just gonna go enjoy my vacation, right? I don't know. Maybe I'm just not following the rules, or maybe I wasn't aware. So currently we are at the house of Ivy's cousin, Rick and Nat. And thank you for having us, and thank you for letting us make a mess at your house. May you guys make us feel welcome here in Australia, Melbourne. Alright guys, I'm going to put my contact lenses in real quick. Come on in. Watch your feet. Lagoon Pier. Anytime you're close to the waters in Australia, you know they are infested with sharks all over Australia. So be careful when you guys go swimming. It's not easy. They don't have a. Uh, there's only certain places that has warning signs for sharks. So just be careful. Swim on. Rocky Road Mega Milkshake. That sounds so good right now. Mmm. I just love chocolate and ice cream. So if you want to share with me your chocolate and ice cream, I'll be your best friend. Check that out. You guys see my drone? Ice cream and gelato time. Thank you. You're welcome. You know, Australia is so peaceful. Melbourne especially. Very laid back city, so peaceful here in Melbourne. It's so quiet, so relaxing. Time goes by so slow here. Really slow. Are there beaches? Check what's behind me. One of the most famous colorful boat sheds in the world. It goes all the way there. Beautiful. Check this out. Can I snake up? <laughs> Good one, Mike. <laughs> she thought there was a snake in there. <laughs> Help! Help me, I'm hungry.
Yes, so Australian Open. Rod Laver, that's the main stage, main center of the Australian Open. Th today is the January 9th and Australian Open opens next week at the 16th. There's nobody here, but next week, city of Melbourne, it's gonna be packed with a lot of people. Grand Slam, Lord, Rod Laver Arena, Australian Open. If you guys like tennis, this is the spot to go. Did you bring your pass? Yeah, 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 yeah. I yeah. forgot my pass. We're supposed to go meet up Djokovic and Federer and Nadal at the backstage. Yeah. They're doing some, you know, strength and conditioning right now. And I've got my VIP pass. Woo! VIP. Nice. VIP. See that? VIP Magic Pass. Lee? VIP for this <laughs> game and tennis. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> VIP. You have your VIP pass? Yes, it's I in my phone. I forgot mine. <laughs> Sorry guys, uh, I can't go with you guys. Man, I forgot my pass. <laughs> ah! But what a game, you know. It was really enjoyable. Five sets, finals, grand finals, grand slam. You guys enjoy the game? Yeah, man. Very good game, man. Yeah, it's a good game. Crazy. It's crazy Amazing, backhand. Man. So hot. So hot. <laughs> hot. But the rally. That was crazy rally, bro. Yeah, it reminds me of uh, VN Antipaso. Yeah. <laughs> and his brother, Jarek. Also, yeah, also uh, yeah, yeah. semi professional. Yeah. Australian Open, man. Yeah. Australian Watching. In about six years, you can see his brother, Jarek. He oh. represents uh, Auckland, New Zealand. So keep an eye on him. Great guy, very humble guy. <laughs> so just so you guys know, we don't have uh, technical difficulties. We got physical difficulties here, <laughs> trying to film. There's so many flies all over. I mean, they're so excited for the Australian Open too. And look at him. Oh god! Look at this guy. It's like break dance. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, mate. Australian Open, wonderful, great experience to be here in Melbourne, Australia. Also, right across the street of Rod Laver Arena is the Olympic Park. That's the park, and that's the holding center. That's where they host all the rugby games. If you guys are familiar with rugby, it's kind of like American football without pads and a few tweaks of the rules and regulations. But pretty tough sport when you play rugby. Very physical. No pads. No thank you. So athletes here in Australia are pretty friendly and they have a good sport due to stage of sportsmanship. So I remember when I was little, my dad and I watched Australian Open. I don't remember who was playing, but it was one of the most precious memories I have from my dad here in Australia. So, thank you, Dad. All right, so we're heading back to the car. We're gonna go grab something to eat. We're hungry, it's about 3 p.m. here in Melbourne. So many flies, ah. So there's dogs over there, so that's why we're walking this way. No standing anytime. Food was really good. It was probably one of the best lechon roasted pig that I've had for such a long time, you know, away from the Philippines. We are underneath the Melbourne Star. Ferris wheel. There's a lot of rides here. You know one thing that I like about the rides here in Australia is I meet the high requirements. Yeah! 
Because that's what you do when there's nothing to do in Melbourne. So while we're here, I'm gonna go check on my boat, make sure everything's all right. Right, the condition of my boats still good the Royal Exhibition building which is this guy Royal Exhibition Center You've been marked. So we're gonna go to Archurva. <laughs> and some mattress. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And some extra turbulence. <laughs> extra turbulence. Churva and turbulence. Is that is that an ice cream? It's a churva. Churva. What's what's churva? Churva. Uh, Chichuvels. <laughs> I love these guys. today of ice cream not enough it's mine oh my god <laughs> so good oh. it's okay that should be an overflow and an overflow